I'm making a type of wine again. Uh, it contains strawberry, it contains raisin and grape, it contains um, red ruby grapefruit, grapefruit different, different juices, and it contains strawberry, apple, and raspberry. First thing we have to do is take out the funnel and start adding these these things to the mix. Can you see? A little bit hard to see, but I'm going to add the uh, red ruby mixture. Close the lid so there's more air space. Then sh shake it some more to give the uh, uh, yeast more oxygen when I when I when I add the material. Can really smell the uh, grapefruit mix, grapefruit juice mix. That should be it for now, and then I'm gonna shake this very well. This is the Oasis Berry mixture. This will make two liters, and the last one will make three liters. Now I gotta get a knife and poke the seal. That should be enough. Maybe a bit more of the apple grape juice. And then what we do, we put the bun on or, or the, or the, um, uh, the uh, rubber stopper and we give it a good shake before we even add the, add the sugar and the yeast. Now we're going to add a cup of sugar. Steps to make it work properly would to be put the stopper onto the glass device and shake it so that the sugar dissolves very well too. Yeah, it can smell the grapefruit juice too. It's quite potent. Now we need to add it's just a little bit of yeast. That should be enough, about a couple grams, a gram or so of yeast should be able to be able to do and then as a final step I'm gonna take the air trap
fill it up with more water. See? New air trap, new air bubbler, airlock. I meant a new airlock. And then, after I'm done, I'm going to clean up some of the stuff that spilled. Because it did spill a bit. And that's it. That's the wine that I'm going to be making. Thanks for watching.